meteorologist Megan McNamara tracking those storms. I see those graphics behind you. Doesn't look good. Yes, all the colors because we do have. <laughs> Some heavy rain moving into the area. So, this particular line that we've really seen kind of tighten up over the past hour or so, just in time to move through the Baltimore area really over the next hour. So, in addition to a line of heavy downpours, it's also producing some strong winds. So, we could see wind gusts with the system 30 to 40 miles an hour. The satellite and radar. So, there's the bigger picture here. Obviously, a good amount of rain out ahead of it. Then we had a little bit of a break, and now we have this line moving through. The back end of it, though, that is all snow. However, the Baltimore area, we're likely not going to see that. We could get a few flurries at the most, I think, but far western Maryland will be dealing with that snow for an extended period of time. Mainly rain for us, thus, this flash flood watch. Now, we do not have, though, any flash flooding at this point. These warnings are just general flood warnings here. So, the areas there of bright green and the flood watch in effect through 4 a.m. In addition to the heavy rain, we're talking strong winds. So, sustained winds out of the south, 20 to 30 miles an hour. And then, as the storms push through, though, we could see those wind gusts up to 50 miles an hour. Here's what we're tracking right now as far as those winds. So, out of the south, yes, and they are kicking here. So, 22 miles an hour for Annapolis, 13 at BWI, 25 in DC, 15 there in Westminster. Let's time out these storms. So, here's the line that I just said was about to move into the Baltimore area. So, we will see it track through over the next hour or so. The eastern shore, you'll be dealing with that same line. Right around 1, 2 a.m. Then the rain really lightens up from there, just general plain rain after that. But we're still seeing a little bit of activity early tomorrow morning. So your kids waking you up at this point to open presents. We could have some scattered showers and, yes, a couple of scattered flurries. I do think, though, tomorrow afternoon and evening, there's a chance that Southern Maryland. You're going to see a batch of some snow showers popping up there. Most of us, though, will be quiet tomorrow as far as precipitation, but the winds will be whipping and it will be very cold. Tonight, temperatures are going to dip down to right around 40 degrees. 40, though, is the high for tomorrow. We hit that in the morning, and then temperatures fall throughout the day. And the, it, in the afternoon, it's going to be in the mid 30s, but feeling like 18, 19 degrees once we factor in those very strong winds. Saturday, the high is 34, lower than what we have for Christmas, but because the winds will be more calm, it'll be less brutal. Good to go for our Ravens on Sunday.